Bud's back in on Saturday against York. Um, if you just want to talk me through your injury you've been out a couple of weeks before that. Yeah, I mean, first uh, first injury I've had, so it's been quite a difficult one to deal with. Um, you know, I think Nisha spoke about it. So I've, uh, basically, I had like, a slip disc, which numbed basically my whole leg through the sciatic nerves. But um, yeah, I got the injection last week, and but good to be back on the pitch on Saturday, but just obviously not the, not the result I wanted. Yeah, I think you, when you're on the pitch, you obviously felt bad. I think you got a, an injection to, to sort it out, but I think you took a, an early dead, dead leg. Yeah, so typical, obviously, I think it's nearly two months of being out and first 10 minutes of the game get a dead leg which kind of killed uh, all the momentum from Saturday but um, you know, 90 minutes back in the tank and uh, yeah, hopefully I can improve from that. Just on Saturday as well, um, obviously I haven't had time to re reflect on it from Saturday but um, how did it go for you? Obviously a, a difficult scoring. Yeah, I mean obviously I've been desperate to get back in. Um, I think all the lads is collectively we know we, we haven't been good enough. It's, it's been disappointing, more than disappointing to be fair. Um, a lot of hope and optimism at the start of the season with with everyone coming back and the new players coming in. We thought, you know, we started really well. Um, Saturday just wasn't good enough, which it's the same for the last, you know, eight, nine results, not good enough. Um, I think we've we've got a standard which we've got to be hitting now. There's, there's no excuses. Um, so, I mean, the first 20 minutes at York was just, you know, it was nothing short of embarrassing. Um, you know, from a player's point of view, everyone was disappointed, but I think there's quite a lot of work also fans, so we can feel that frustration, especially when they're travelling their numbers down to York, um, followed by, you know, Chester, same, a, a very bad result down there, so um, I think from our point of view, we've definitely got to sort it out right now. Yeah, just before Saturday, obviously, you'd, you'd been watching from the sidelines, obviously, a tough run of results. How difficult was it for you to sort of watch the lads, albeit sort of struggling in terms of results? Yeah, put it this way, I'm pleased it's my first injury because uh, yeah, it absolutely killed us sitting on the sideline, um, you know, kicking every ball, hitting every ball, uh, you know, cheering the lads on as best as I could, but very frustrating, you know. Um, I think it probably would have been easier if we were getting the results, you know, winning here and there, but. Um, been a very frustrating period, but I think we've got absolutely no option now. But on Saturday to, to put everything right, um, not just for the gaffer, but for every single fan who's been turning in week out, week, week in, week out, and uh, we've got to get a result on Saturday. It's as simple as that. Yeah, it might be tough to put your sort of thing on it, but what do you think's changed from the sort of the, the first month to now? Do you think? See, I think we had a few injuries at the start. Do you think that sort of killed momentum or? Yeah, I mean, obviously don't get wrong, I think myself and Nipper, there's been a couple of others getting knocks, you know, I think Jordan Hickey missed out, obviously Gilly's first game of the season, um, I think he, he's, he would have been a massive player for it, but um, yeah, I think it's definitely killed momentum, I think that's probably the right way to put it, but it's also, we've got to look at ourselves, you know, we, we haven't done enough on a Saturday, um, and like I say, there's only one, one, like, collectively as a group, there's only us that we can put it right now, um, and that has to start this weekend, there's no excuses, we, we'll be training tonight, training Thursday and like I say, Saturday really hurt, you know, obviously that's my first game back, it's, it's been hurting us not winning and um, especially after the, t the last two years, you know, when I came back I, I said I didn't want to be like associated with that kind of um, that kind of performances and you know, that's exactly what's happened, so from my point of view it's not good enough and um, I think all the lads feel exactly the same. Yeah, as captain, what is what are you sort of, or what can you do as as captain? Do you feel that to help the lads get through, or is it a sort of needs a, a team effort as well for all the lads to get around you, rather than just yourself? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I think everyone knows that it's not been good enough. Um, for myself personally, obviously, I'm kind of just getting back into it on Saturday. But now, it's, you know, my job is to make sure everyone can stay positive because we showed what we can do at the start of the season, you know, we can get it down and play and we, we can score the goals and, and, and get the three points comfortably. Um, there's no doubt we haven't got the talent, it's just a case of making sure we get back to the basics on Saturday and um, playing the same football that we were and just getting back to enjoying it, I think. You know, I think that maybe is a, once you get one or two bad results, the pressure starts to mount and kind of affects people's game, but I think we've got to put that all behind us and go out there on Saturday and make sure we put it right. Yeah, obviously important to get a result on the pitch on Saturday as well, but important that the fans keep coming back. I know it's been a difficult period, but obviously we hope that they'll still come and, come and support us. Oh, without a doubt. Like I said, 207 there at York, you know, the, the outsung every single one of the York fans. Um, it's massively appreciated. And we started with some great numbers, and obviously from our results, it's kind of dropped off, but we'll, we'll start to correct things on the pitch, and hopefully the fans can come back and but it's down to us to, to get, gain their trust and make sure they want to come back and uh, watch us put on performance.